Hello and welcome to BMNG Drive. I'm David in Art, and today I'm going to put together, um, it's I guess it's kind of a compilation, I don't know. Anyway, I was watching uh, Mythbusters uh, over the weekend, and so oops, I thought I would do some things that I saw them do on the show. The first thing I'm going to do is get this puppy up to 40 miles an hour, and uh, we've got the... Uh, ram on the front of this and of course we've got cars lined up and i'm a little off center <laughs> that's okay that worked out halfway decent not, not quite the same uh effect they had on the show oh this oh oh oh, oh. come on oh man that is so cool <laughs> That is awesome. I love it. All right. Oh, man. Oh, blew the... Ah, uh, uh, you know what? That's okay. Right. We, we, we got it. Oh, oops. <laughs> that, did <not. laughs> well, that didn't work out well at all, did it? Okay. Wow. A little off-center, and guess what? The whole thing kind of falls apart. All right, here we go. Let's see what happens uh, if I can keep the truck steady <laughs> i have no idea oh i should probably slow it down too when it starts to get close oh look at this this is beautiful oops i went off a little center a little bit oh but that's so cool <laughs> oh good heavens what a mess Oh, there goes the truck. I, I forgot to stop the truck. All right, this time I've moved the truck back much further. Uh, in the show, the uh, truck they used, uh, they set the speed at 40 miles an hour. This one, I'm just going to ramp it up. I'm just going to hold down the gas pedal. Let's just see how fast we can get and how hard we can hit these cars. And we'll just see what happens. <laughs> I have no idea. Definitely going to do some slowdown here. And see if I can get the camera to come around because this is so. This is at a little over 60. Holy cow! That is awesome! Whoa, look at that! <laughs> I picked up a hitchhiker. There we go. Oh, slam! Oh, that is so cool. Holy smokes. Oh, this should be... This will either be great or it'll be a disaster. Alright, well, we're up to 50. Trying to keep it between the lines. 60. we got to be getting close. Almost 70. Yes! Yes! Oh, that was phenomenal! Holy cow! Oh, that was great! Oh! Okay, and I figured out the audio clue to let me know when I'm getting close. We gotta see that in slow motion, man. Oh my gosh, that was fantastic! Alright, here we go. Slow motion! Oh, yeah! <laughs> That is totally wicked. All right, now I have another idea that I saw. Um, actually, there's two other things I'm gonna try just to see if we can kind of mimic in a way what they did on Mythbusters. So uh, stay tuned. Uh, we're gonna cut to that in just a second here. All right, so um, I actually didn't see the episode involving this particular myth they were trying to bust. I'm sure it had to do something with splitting a car in half with another car. Um, I'm just going to let this run and see what happens. <laughs> I have no idea. Mm -hmm. Oh! oh. <laughs> wow. Well, that definitely didn't split it in half. Huh. All right, I'll tell you what, let me uh, set this back up and let's try this puppy in slow motion. All right, here we go. In slow motion, here's the shadow. Oh, <laughs> that car 
just it does not uh it's definitely not going to split in half um when that blue car lands man it's just when the bullite hits the taxi how often do your parents say that one when the bullite hits the taxi anyway uh it, it's coming down right on those seats but even if that wasn't the case i don't think uh we're not definitely not going to see it cutting in half um for those of you that uh, play around with uh, BeamNG, uh, when I go into the editor mode, I'm raising up the bolide up to a Z factor of 45. So I don't know if raising it up any higher would produce anything. Um, I don't know. I may, I may give that a shot and let's just see what happens. I'm afraid what's going to happen is that wind drift is going to come into play and my, the cars won't land together. But let's take a look. We'll see what happens. All right, here we go. I've raised the uh, bolide up to a Z of 75, and um, I have no idea if there's a correlation to how far the what the Z factor is in relation to feet or meters, any of that kind of stuff. So if you happen to know that, uh, by all means, leave a comment down below, and uh, I'll be able to use that in the future to gauge how how far different things are from other pieces and parts that I'm putting together. But anyway enough talking we want to see some destruction <laughs> so we're going to do this and again we're going to slow this down holy cow i have no idea where that car is man. i hope it even lands uh here we go oh now that wow look at that holy cow that is awesome that is awesome. Oh, man, that is cool. <laughs> All right. Man. Okay, I want to see that at full speed. So let me get this reset. And we're going to do this again. All right. So now we wait for the bull ride. Wow. Fall out of the sky. <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> that took a lot less time than I thought it was going to. Oh, look at that, though. Look at that. Woo. Holy cow. We're definitely not going to split the car in half, but, oh. Now, part of me wonders if it's not splitting in half because the ground is in the way, right? So, if there was a way that I could get this car suspended. Oh, I, I have an idea. I don't know if it's going to work. Let's see if I can set something up here. All right, here we go. As you can see, I've propped up the car using two other grand marshals so that we could see what happens when we release the bolide. Oh! <laughs> I, I'm, I might need taller vehicles. Look at that. that is <laughs> oh, that is so cool. Oh my gosh, that's wicked. All right, so I need to be even higher off the ground, right? Is that what we're saying? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that is so cool. Okay, <laughs> I ran into a weird glitch uh, as I was trying to set things up. Um, you'll notice the bolide changes because I couldn't remember exactly what I had in place, but that won't matter. In true Mythbusters fashion, I set up a dump truck and a um, cement truck. The uh, bolide is 100 Z units up in the air. And now we're going to let her ride <laughs> or fly or fall or whatever you want to call it. Oh, oh man. <laughs> Holy cow. That is awesome. Oh my gosh. All right. Well, we didn't get the bull eye to split the taxi cab in half. But we certainly got it to fold over in half. That is so, so cool. Awesome. All right. I got another thing I'm going to try. And so uh, I'll be right to back with that. All right. So on Mythbusters, they tried to take a vehicle and split it in half. And I'm going to, um, although I don't believe there's a way I could remotely do that in the game, we're going to replicate the scenario as best we can. Now, uh, they ultimately connected or, or hooked up a, a rocket sled to their car and shot it through, and they got the car to split in half. 
we're not going to be able to do that. But we've got something close, at least I think. Um, we have the bollard, or bollard, or however you say that word. Basically, it's a pole that sticks up out of the ground. And we're going to drive about 200 miles an hour into this post. And we're going to see what happens. So let's see. It should be coming up here. Um, I tried to target this to where it was around the 200 mile an hour mark um, for this. Uh, I hope I can actually hit the freaking thing. Because you know me, there's a good chance I'll miss it completely. And that would not be good at all. Let's see here. should be coming. Come on. Where are you? <laughs> oh, there it is. Uh, well, we didn't split it in half, but we absolutely wrapped the car around it. That is awesome. <laughs> oh, yeah. We're going to have to see that in slow motion. So let me, uh, oops, let me get everybody reset. Holy cow. All right. Let me get this reset. All right. Here we go. Oh, man. I skimmed the side. <laughs> I did not. <laughs> oh. Wow. Look at that is crazy though. Look at that. Oh, well, I broke the physics. Tartar sauce. All right, I am going to try this again. <laughs> well, once again, didn't quite wrap it around the pole. <laughs> and broke physics again. Ah, oh, man. All right, so I set this up for the AI to handle all of this just because I'm curious to see what happens when we let the AI take control. Oh, man, this is cool. <laughs> oh, this is a lot of fun being able to work the camera without, you know, messing with the, the actual controls at the same time all right holy cow oh he hits a corner too <laughs> okay it's gonna break i know it's gonna break you know it's gonna break there's banding all over the place i'm gonna leave it in slow motion oh that is so very very cool. Let's see what happens. Sure, we're only going 125 miles an hour. Why not look around? See what's happening. Hey, how's it going? <laughs> uh, very cool. Oh, I do have an idea, though. Um, check this out. Let's watch this from the perspective of the actual Bullard. Oh, yeah. Holy cow. Dude. Oh, beautiful. That's exactly what I was looking for. Oh, that is awesome, man. <laughs> oh, that is fantastic. Look at that. I even managed to damage the uh, Miramar anyway. Holy cow. Wow, that is awesome. All right, I'm going to leave this here. We'll get this all put together for you, and uh, hopefully it turns out to be a very fun uh, kind of an homage to uh, Mythbusters. If you like the video, hit the like button. If you would, feel free to leave any questions, problems, suggestions, horror stories down in the comments section below. Remember to, I don't know, click the little bell, ring the little bell, jingle the little bell, whatever it is that lets you get notifications so that you know when I'm posting new stuff. I appreciate that as always. And thank you guys so, so much for watching. Um, it, it means a whole lot to me that through all the YouTube craziness, you guys are still coming out and checking out the videos. Thank you so, so much. We'll see you next time.